Hey guys. I realized that I didn't show you guys me installing my NVMe drives. I did one on the motherboard, but I didn't show the other one, so in this video I'm gonna be showing you guys. I use this Silverstone PCIe adapter. Then I'm gonna be using this Western Digital Black NVMe drive, which I'm gonna be installing, and I'm gonna use my X16 slot on my motherboard. I already have one installed right here. You guys can see this one right here, and then there's the one on my main board, my Samsung 960 Pro here. I'm going to install this one so you guys can see. Here's the card, which I've already did an unboxing on this card. Then you get the little screw here. That you use on the card. You guys can see that. First you have to take the sticker off. It has a little sticker on it here. To take that off. Get that out of the way. The only thing hard about this is these little teeny screws that they give you. These little things. Oh my goodness. Okay. And when you put the card on, you're going to have to put this. These little things. My goodness. These little teeny things, you can put it on the, the mime, you put it on the end here. Since it's a, it's, it's marked 2280, you guys can see. So I have to put it on the end here. And then the other piece, which is this little teeny, I can get that into. This shot here, and you guys can see it, it's a little blurry. Then a little nut here that you put on the other side to hold it together. These things are so small, it, it's unbelievable. That's what you have to work with. I hand tighten mine, I haven't had a problem with it. Yeah, I just hand tightened it right on there, like that. Now it's in there. Then I grab my drive, install it in here like that. That's in there. And then I grab the microscopic screw they give you right here. And that goes on next. I right, see if I can put it on my screwdriver here. It's so small. So small. No. Too small. I need a microscopic screwdriver. Yeah, and I do. Here it is. This little bad boy right here. And it right there. Perfect. And you get this. And put that right in. There you screw it in. Voila. It's in there. And you move your slot out which slot you're gonna use. Which is the last slot here. I mean this is my last X16 lane at the end. I'll be using that slot.
that up. And just insert the card in your last slot. Got to line it up just right, guys. So, and make sure it's lined up when you do it. Like mine here, it's not lining up right, but Got my motherboard's in the way back here. Some, somehow, it's caught in here. Alright, I just installed that. It was off alignment for some reason. I don't know what was my bracket in the back here is bent for some reason. But I got it I got it aligned. It's right in my uh slot here. Just put my screw back on my bracket here. It's in there. Okay. Good. Now I have two next. To, they're right next to each other there. I can see that. No. It's fire though. Let me flip this back up. See if it picks up my drive. Right. To my monitor here. Gotta see if this picks up my my drive in the system now. Okay guys, now what I just did, I just went into this management, on Windows 10 you just right click the logo and you'll see this management, let me zoom in on it, I don't know if you guys can see it, and you'll see right there, this management on that. And then I just go up here 
and I see that my new volume has been picked up it's right oh it's in my turn my focus here that's not good there we go how about that guys I'm all out of focus but you can see my third line here is the NVMe I just installed and it picked it up just fine so now I just to format it. And I'll format it real quick. Get that out of the way. Open it up. There it is. It's ready to go. It's been formatted and everything. So it's ready to be used. So, right now I have three NVMe drives hooked up to this PC. All of them are 512 gigabytes. So that's it, guys. I hope it helps someone and I thank you guys for watching my video. Bye-bye.